Hello, everybody. Ever since Heartland announced the death of Ty Borden back in 2021, fans have been questioning whether he really died or will one day return to the show, and this is all a play. Why? Well, the biggest thing is Ty was there since the very beginning, and no one could imagine a Heartland without him. He was a vital part of this family and show, and we're still struggling to believe that the show is going on without him. His impact on all the Fleming Bartlett tribe members was tremendous, and thus, his absence created this massive feeling of emptiness that we hate to see. Besides, he was one of few gentlemen that the TV screen has ever seen. As you all know, for the most part in TV shows, the most toxic the relationship, the more likely the show is to be watched. Surprisingly, Heartland took a different route in that and created this amazing man who combines everything women need in their life into a single being. He is smart, good-looking, filled with love, kind, and most importantly, highly respectful. Therefore, Amy was feeling like being supported at all times. She was feeling blessed constantly and with her, we were also feeling blessed to watch such a man and witness a healthy relationship. Thus, his absence heavily impacted the presence of a good man on TV and we're sad to see it. Now, we know that we have been talking as if Ty has truly died in Heartland Season 14. Well, he did. At least it seems like he did. But what if he didn't? What if there is a chance for him to return? There are a lot of fans arguing some different theories about Ty's situation in Heartland. We all know that Ty is being killed off because Graham Wardle, who was playing Ty, decided to leave the show. Some fans argue that once Wardle gets sick of his other ventures, he might want to return to Heartland one day. For such a case, fans argue, the show owners probably prepared a B-plan so that they can make Ty return to the show. One of those B-plan theories is that Ty is actually in a coma and since Jack doesn't want Amy to suffer for so long, he decided to declare Ty dead. We know that it sounds crazy, but once you think about it, it's not impossible. Jack is always known for taking care of Amy and there is a strong chance that he would do anything to save her from suffering for so long waiting for someone to get out of his coma hopelessly. Another theory claims that once Wardle returns, the entirety of the last two seasons will be declared a dream and we will continue from where we left off back in season 13. Now, this sounds cheesy. But even though we normally hate any movie or book with such a premise, we believe this might actually work in Heartland since it would enable the show to get a second chance at winning the fans' hearts. Another theory is focusing on the scenario of Wardle not wanting to return to show like ever. In that case, fans argue that we can get yet another tie who has gone through a facial operation. Why? Well, these fans claim that after years of coma tie has lost his memory and has gone through a lot of terrible stuff in his newly found life. Naturally, his face is also impacted by that, and he got older in a short time. Thus, when he returned, he doesn't look like his true self. Would that be convincing enough for us? We're not sure. Let us know what you think in the comments below and don't forget to like, subscribe and share the video. Thank you for watching. See you soon.